Okay, um, I'm keen to ask you about the protests that we've seen this week outside uh, Batley Grammar School. This is after a teacher showed an offensive cartoon of the Prophet Muhammad. Uh, the schools apologised, suspended the teacher who's now under police protection. Should teachers be allowed to show cartoons of the Prophet Muhammad? Well, look, in, in this particular case, I think we just need to lower tensions. Firstly, the school has actually taken action, as you've mentioned, in relation to this, which I think was the right thing to do. But what we've now got to do move, moving forward is absolutely to be putting children, learners first, lowering those tensions now and actually moving forward. I think that is what is absolutely uh, essential now, because to continue... To, to raise tensions in this situation certainly isn't going to assist anybody, least, le least alone those people who absolutely should be coming first, who are those who are learning at that school in Batley. But you think suspending the teacher was the right thing to do? Look, I, I, I think the school has acted. That has now obviously taken place. That action has happened. I think what now needs to happen, as I say, is we need to lower the tension and we need now to actually move on putting the children first. We can't have either any situations where teachers or others are somehow intimidated trying to go about their work. That is something that's not acceptable. What we have to do is to move on now and ensure that the children have that learning, particularly at the moment when you consider all the disruption there's been to young people's education over the past 12 months. That absolutely has to come first.